championship weekend. First game, Chiefs versus Ravens. Ravens are at home. Don't you dare. God, I it. want the Ravens don't to you, win this game. Don't you dare. Do we want to do predictions first, or do we want to analyze the aspects of the game first? Let's analyze first. Okay. Yeah. I think the Chiefs need to be really concerned about Lamar's running game. Absolutely. Patrick, yeah. Patrick, uh, not Patrick Mahomes. Josh Allen ran all over that Chiefs defense. I obviously think Josh Allen as a runner is very different than Lamar as a runner. But Well, one's a Ford F-150. One's, one's a Ferrari. Yep, yeah. yeah. And obviously, I think they ske- more of Lamar's runs are schemed runs. Yep. Josh Allen more runs out of the pocket. But Willie Gay got injured during the uh, that was, Bills that's game. That's going to be a tough loss. And he might play. I don't know if his status mm-hmm. is confirmed. But it's going to be a big factor. Um, I think Ravens have an edge in terms of like how Chiefs defended the quarterback run last week. Yep. They're going to have a tougher time this week with that. Um, Ravens are obviously on better rest. The mm-hmm. Chiefs have been having to play kind of like a lot of football recently. Yep. Um, two really cold games leaves a lot like the hurt, the hits hurt more. Yeah. And everything like that. Um, obviously they're on the road. Um, I think the Ravens are going to have to really get creative with how they use their receivers. Um, yeah, Sneed is great. McDuffie Sneed's is going to lock. Yeah, and, those two are really going to. And those down receivers there. didn't do much against the Texans. Now, I obviously they were having a lot of success running the football. Yeah, in that game, so I don't know like what is what. Nelson La- Aguilar. Nelson Aguilar legacy game. Yep. <laughs> but God. I think the Chiefs have a clear advantage there, where like kind of match up Sneed against say Flowers and. They can kind shut of, down the receivers, but I think the run game is going to be where. Well, it and that's like them. that's where I think it's like can how it, can the Ravens' run game get going? Yeah. Because I don't think they're going to have much success passing the ball yeah. against the Chiefs. Mm-hmm. Um, I really think this game is going to be a defensive battle. Oh, I yeah, so 100%. Too. I don't know what the over-under is, um, but I think it's going to be a low-scoring game just because... <laughs> I just can't wait for this to get clipped when it's like 59. Yeah, yeah it's going to be <laughs> like 59, 48 or something um, like over, that. Over-under is 44 and a half. 44 oh, and a half. Low, yeah, yeah, 22 yeah. each. Um, I thought the Chiefs' bills would go under. Obviously, the Chiefs had a little bit more success scoring the ball than I thought they would. But I think it's going to be a defensive battle because the Ravens' defense is really. It good. should be a defensive battle. Yep. Yeah. Um. I don't know if anyone. The has spread any other is three and a half. I mean, there's the spread's two, only three and a half. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. It's going to be a close game, and it's going to be a very defensively heavy game. I think. Um. Unless the Ravens get their run game going, and if they do get that run game going, I, I don't game. think that I don't think the Chiefs can stop the bleeding after that point. Yeah. Because like we see, we saw Dalvin Cook starting to torch the Chief of uh, the Texans' defense. Yeah. And. Like I don't know if they because they rotated Justice Hill, Gus Edwards, Dalvin Cook, mm-hmm. Lamar too at that point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Them four got it going, and it was just over for the Texans. And I feel like if the Chiefs let that run game start going, I don't know if they can stop it because once you try to put all your assets into the box, then that's where it's... Zay Flowers is going to have a legacy game. Yeah, because then he's going to be able to throw the slants and everything, and then yeah, yeah. I mean, it's it's strange because they're both built kind of similarly. Um, I think the Ravens offense overall, I think currently is better. Um, but when it comes to like being able to make adjustments and stuff mm-hmm. like that, I think Andy Reed definitely Andy Reed and Patrick Mahomes will be able to dial something up because they both have like very solid run games that they've, that they've kind of switched into decent pass games. I think the, uh, the Ravens uh, pass game is definitely better. Um, Ravens defense is definitely better. Um, I think their their secondary is a little bit weaker, I think, mm-hmm. than the Chiefs. Um, but when it comes to like a front seven, yeah, um, and linebackers, their line, the, yeah, Roquan Smith at linebacker is. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna be the key yeah. difference. You in this cannot game. let Roquan Smith get to Patrick Mahomes all game. No, no the they're not gonna. They can't let uh, Jadavion Clowney. Yeah, Clowney get, too. They can't let Clowney get to him because the thing is, is that it's gonna be Roquan Smith. I think is gonna be the definitive uh, game changer in this mm-hmm. game if he can come up in the run game shed blocks and stop Isaiah Pacheco relatively close to the line. It's going to force the chiefs to pass more. And with Kyle Hamilton screaming down yep. there, like breaking up passes and stuff like that. I think that's where the chiefs are really going to get in trouble. They have good linebackers and safeties and match up with Travis Kelsey, who gets a lot of those matchups. Very fa- Roquan Smith is a very fast linebacker. You can yep. keep up. Patrick queen is a much more run stopping guy. He's not great in coverage, um, but he's still solid. Um, and he'll pro- he'll probably be able to keep up with the other tight ends yep. um, besides Kelsey. So it's- and it, it makes a huge difference. I mean, you saw the Bills; um, they were really depleted in the secondary and li- at linebacker. And, so depleted. And linebacker. Travis Kelsey was finding gaps like we're used to finding him in soft spots in the zone. Yep. Um, we make our predictions. Let's hear it. Me first. Yeah. yeah. You. The Chiefs are. Gonna I win. swear to. F- oh my god. <laughs> the Chiefs are going to win. Patrick Mahomes is thirteen and three. 
in his playoff career. Two of those losses were in the Super Bowl. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, not two of them. One of them was in the Super Bowl. He lost yeah. to Brady in the Super Bowl when his offensive line was getting mauled by the Bucs to Brady because <laughs> they were so yeah. injured. He lost in overtime to Brady yeah. when it was last year or second yeah. last year with the Patriots. And he lost, and he lost in overtime to Joe Burrow in the yeah. AFC Championship yeah. game. Yeah. So unless the Ravens win in overtime or because his offensive line is getting mauled, I just I'm not betting against the Chiefs. I don't like I can That's make fair. I can make some analysis you know on why I think they're gonna win again. I think their secondary is a big I think the Ravens are going to have a tough time passing the ball, and I think they're going to have something in store. I think they let Josh Allen run around a little bit more because Josh Allen. I think they no. I think they let Josh. Oh, Allen run. oh, oh, oh! I think they let him run a lot more because a lot of it was more scramble stuff. Where I think they're going to have a lot more stuff schemed got up it, to it. stop the Lamar run. I think Snead, Snead's having such a good season that yeah. I think Zay Flowers is going to probably be rendered. I, I'm not going to say useless, but I think he's going to be really definitely sure. limited. Yeah, definitely limited. Um. I think the offense and Patrick Mahomes is really good as a dog. He's really good against the spread as a yeah, dog. And the, the reason the spread matters is the spread is three and a half. So sure. It's close. So if like, if they're going to cover the spread, it's going to be a really tight game. And yep. the, the person I trust in tight games is it's Patrick, Patrick Mahomes. Mahomes. Damn it. And it, call it like, okay, the Ravens might have a better offense. They might have a better defense, but who shows up? The play who's the got game? the X factor. And yeah. it just, yeah, it's no, it, no, you're, you're, it, it makes sense. Like, it's not yeah, a bad yeah. take. And I mean, could I see the Ravens winning the game? Absolutely. Like, there's no, yeah, like, yeah. it's not like the Chiefs are bona fide. I was very confident the Bills, I mean, the Chiefs were beating the Bills. I'm not as confident the Chiefs are beating the Ravens, but is this like a 51 49 kind of thing or is this 60 40? 60 40? Yeah. Um, but maybe even 65 35. Oh, okay. But, okay. um, I just think when you look at the way the Chiefs have lost in the playoffs before, it would either have to be a first time for the Ravens or they have very, very, very limited room for error. Yeah. And that's not what I would, I would not want to have little room for error against Patrick Mahomes and Andy Reid. So I think the chiefs find their way back to their fourth Super Bowl. Good Lord. I just hate the chiefs. I don't, <laughs> I'm tired of seeing the chiefs in the Super Bowl every other year, every year at this point, I just want something different. I just, I don't care what the spread is. I don't care how much the Ravens, as long as the Ravens win that game, I just want to see something different. Like I could care less, but Raj, do you think the I Ravens, still think the Ravens are going to dog walk that? Well, not dog walk. Whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, you said it. You, you said, it. said it. You said it. Ravens by six. Okay. Interesting. <sighs> now the issue is that Justin made some very convincing points. <laughs> As I did last week. As and you, you, did almost, last week. you almost flipped last I week. I almost did. I almost did. Don't listen to the analytics. Go with emotion. <laughs> Do not listen to the analytics. They I, lie to you. I think this is Lamar's year. I okay. it's there's something just about this team that just feels consistent and like they can just win and this this team reminds me a lot of like kind of those earlier ravens teams where obviously it's it's very different because of like you know the defense is obviously nowhere comparable but it's much more of like the ravens have found their identity in having a like smash mouth defense that will hit you with a line of scrimmage great linebackers great safety pretty solid secondary and they lean heavy on the run game, and they have like they have a quarterback that can make the throws when he needs to. But of course, Lamar Jackson is that X factor. I think that's going to be in the game where I don't think the Chiefs linebackers are going to be able to keep up with them. Yeah, I I just don't think they're going to be able to. It's a tough spot for their linebackers. I mean, again, I think Willie Gay, if he's healthy, is a huge component of this game. And I mean, yeah. maybe. When people are watching us, we'll have an injury report yeah. on him. But and of course, Nick Bolton is a great linebacker. Um, I think they had uh, Tranquil come yep. off like he's like a the guy they pulled up um, from like the practice squad, I think, or they uh, took him from another team or something. He's been playing great, but Lamar Jackson is just different. Like yep. Patrick Mahomes has lost by like set more than seven points once in his career or something. This is going to be a great football game. This yep. is going to be there's, a great football I, game. There's no situation. The Chiefs are not good enough, in my opinion, to beat to blow out the Ravens. And Patrick Mahomes does not get blown out. So this is going to be an all time classic. I, yeah, I just, I think for me, it's like a 51 49 kind of yeah. thing, leaning up just slightly to the Ravens, just because I feel like it's, it's just a gut feeling. And I, I mean, just, listen, the Super Bowl colors 
have to matter. It has to be purple. It has to be purple. It, I mean, it when, it, to be when, purple. when you're thinking about one percent, like you one and a half percent go to the Ravens and yeah. they break over the barrier. A little like, bit. come on, yeah, yeah, of course, because we also saw the script leaked apparently on some Canadian t- uh, news thing, whereas <laughs> the 49ers versus the Ravens, whatever. Lamar, go win. 